straight into the basement or the kitchen. The kitchen is not huge, but it's really well utilized in terms of the space. I get you can move around in here. You could always actually put a counter in over here instead of the breakfast nook if you really wanted to. The windows are high, so a lot of times that doesn't allow for it, but they're high enough that you can do that if you want more counter space. I mean, it's in good shape. You got a new fan here. Looks like they painted. <clears throat> Hardwood's in nice shape. Here's your living room. So just in terms of general feel, if you compare it to that place that we saw on the corner together in Tosa, the first place we saw, it's definitely bigger than that. It's not as small. It has more of a traditional single family feel. These, these rooms are nice size. So, got some closet space. Second bedroom, using as an office, but perfectly fine size. Looks like they've redone this bathroom recently. Yeah, everything's pretty new in here. This could be a flip. Meh, probably not. The floor isn't that new in here. Hard to say, but they've definitely done done some work. It's freshly painted. It does have original windows, but that's not a big deal. Uh, original cabinets with new hardware, as you can see. They're in fine shape. Looks like they put new counters in. Gonna go into the basement here. Yeah, so Looks like it was like kind of finished a while ago. Got this old flooring in here. Got a little bit of uh, pretty normal moisture in the corner of the house like you usually see. Pretty big down here. I mean, if you ever wanted to finish this space, you could easily do that, easily. Um, yeah, you, you, you got some of the dry lock peeling off here. That's again, pretty normal. Not hard to do yourself. So, all right, let's check out. Oh, look at this heater. Thing's a big old beast. I'll have to see if there's anything in the, uh, man. Yeah, look at that. I wonder if there's uh, anything in the listing about this, maybe a home, home warranty with it, because that thing is old, but those things, these can go forever, frankly. And then it looks like your water heater is very new. It's only five years old, so. Electrical looks pretty good over here in the corner. You don't have glass block, that would probably help. You're getting a little bit of, uh, you can see along the carriage beam here, there's some some cracking. It doesn't seem to be coming out of plumb. You can see they did some fixing of it at one point, but you'd need a guy just coming in from water that, not a big deal. Um, but I would say at some point, you'd probably just want to get glass block windows down here. Wouldn't be terribly expensive, and it doesn't need to be done right away. Just one of those things that would help with the maintenance of the home. So as far as the moisture goes, uh, it's really just that one corner that I'm seeing, you know, there's a touch there, but it's, that's all, you know, it's, it's pretty good here. Um, you, it looks like you have some kind of leak here from this. Yeah, this is dripping and it, I think it's leaking a little bit under there, but that's whatever. Super small. All right.
I'll just go back upstairs real quick and do one more pan for you, and that'll be about it. I mean, this place is totally moving ready. Way better than what we saw yesterday. Minus the old heater, but like I said, that thing can go forever. Could go tomorrow too. <laughs> Anyways, really nice. Okay. That's about it.